Dear Diary, so, uh, it's now, uh, Tuesday, March 7th, it's 10 and 24 a.m., and it's 16 degrees outside. Thankfully, I was able to sleep, uh, quite decently yesterday, and, um, I'm awake with, uh, it's quite a weird combination, but it's but at least it's not harmful. Such as my eyes are a little bit uh, cold, with a little bit of tears coming down, which is kind of weird. But not like the real tears, and I barely even drop any tears when being sad or crying anyway. My head's a little bit shaken up. Um, my throat is a tiny bit, uh, burning, but then it would be, but then it's not as burning as the other uh, throat, as the other throat that used to literally burn me to death. You know, thankfully I'm not as sick as I used to be, you know, and, um, right now, I might either continue sleeping until 12 p.m. or something, or um, just stay up for a while and injecting more fantasies while I'm just sitting down, because, yeah, that's the least that you can do, I guess. There's pretty much nothing else than... Oh, and... Yeah, thank God that nothing... Nothing else got destroyed... On the social media, you know? Thank God that I did not have to... Literally witness another bullshit... On my end... On the social media... Like, it's been all quiet and barely any interactive, which is, which is what I want, honestly, you know, and I personally don't care whether I'm going to be barely getting any interactions or any of that, and, um, it's really, it's really a nice it's really the nicest, you know, state that you could ever have. Because <sighs> too much interactions means too much trouble. Less interactions, less troubles. That's, uh, that's quite the good rules of social media. Like, I would rather have too much interactions with my current friends than having too much interactions with a lot of new people that potentially are gonna destroy my goddamn day and completely ruin it and make me disappointed even more in humanity more than I'm already disappointed. Uh, yeah. Which is Literally a one-way ticket to, uh, to a complete fuckery, to be honest. <sighs> Aside of all that, it is uh, half summer, half winter nowadays, which is honestly quite confusing weather. Like, you can't even tell whether you're going to... Whether you're going to have to go back into wearing the stuff under the, under the clothes or you just take them off and wait until summer comes in and literally get the summer clothes out. Who knows? And of course I'm going to be trying to play more and more games. Especially more eight Nintendo's eight bit ones, or um, 
maybe a little bit of Metro games. Who knows? Really, who knows? It's um, it's quite a surprise timeline. Oh, well. At any case, um, that's it, I guess, for the time being. Just gonna hope that uh, that the rest of the day, when I wake up at 12 p.m. or something, is a lot more better. You know that like gets into a better state and maybe one day I know I've been saying that a lot but I'm just at a state where where I literally regret and deeply regret ditching the ones that were actually there for me like uh, like someone called Nate uh, another one called Morrigans, another one called, um, Amy, aka, uh, a one Sakura role player on Twitter. Um, that one, uh, Oriyame role player, um, and of course, um, that other uh, bike glue, guy glue, I can't even remember. But they, had, but they had an OC that they were role playing as mainly. And yeah, that was also one of the people that I've ditched. And um, the main reason why I've ditched half of those because if they weren't active enough, quote unquote. Sorry, quote unquote, act and aren't active enough, which is of course the stupidest reason you could ever have to ditch someone with. But not anymore. Like I have lately learned that. Oh, and uh, Amanda, aka a uh, Sunny something, uh, Caleb. And I don't even know the, the current made up name, but they role play as Sephiroth on Twitter. And, um, like I said, I deeply regret, um, I deeply regret ditching them like that. They were, they were like the best friends that I did not know that I have ever had all along. And I am, thanks to that, I'm all alone. Completely all alone in that fucked up state. I really wish I could see them again, hear from them, literally know anything about them, or even know how to even reach out to them anymore. Oh well. I guess that's karma for me. That's karma for me for ditching all those amazing people. I'm not joking. That's karma for me. And, um, that just made me learn in the hard way that the real friends are the ones that you have made and that were ever with you ever since you left Twitter. While the others that you were trying to reach into, especially the fucking girls, are the f absolute fake ones and they were wrong they were really wrong about that I bet that they hate me and have already forgotten about me well I could have done better than that anyways uh, that's it for now and hopefully it just the day goes decently and see you all later.